Hi, welcome to Suna, the world's first virtual product photography studio. Today we are breaking down our top three tips for photographing jewelry through macro shots, neutral colors, and full body models. So without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right in. Macro lenses. By using macro lenses, we can get intricate details and close-up shots to the subject. This is great for showing off engravings and other subtleties that would otherwise be missed. When thinking about your shot list, this is one of the most important shots to get when placing these products in your online store. Moving on to tones. Try to keep in mind the color of backdrops you use. We recommend neutral backdrops to help blend the scene together. This means sticking with light colors such as white, cream, or gray. This boils down to preference, but this technique gives us a light and airy tone that helps sell the delicate feeling of jewelry. Most importantly, using neutral colors help keep focus on the product without any distractions. We want your jewelry to shine, no pun intended. Really? Last but not least, the best way to showcase your pieces is by adding one of our pro service full body models. It's worth noting that if you exclusively sell rings, adding a hand model will get the job done. But for any earrings, necklaces, or bracelets, we highly recommend adding full body models to really portray how your jewelry falls. If you hire a full body model, hand modeling is included. To recap, we are experts when it comes to jewelry photography. We have captured so many SKUs for so many artisans. We can capture gorgeous assets that will look good on any e-commerce site. If you're ready to give Suna a try, we have an Etsy starter pack. It includes a pre-built shoot that includes five images with a hand model to show off one product. We also linked a blog post with more tips for photographing jewelry if you want to try at home. Be sure to subscribe for any new future guides and tips. Thanks for watching and we'll see you Suna.